Hi, you guys. I am entering a birthday challenge for Crafty Sue 519 here on YouTube, and it is called OMG I'm Turning 70. I believe that's it. Um, go to the description box for the exact details and the link to her introduction video for the challenge. So I know she wanted a handmade birthday card, so I made this. She also wanted either a sequence mix, charms, or old buttons. So I did a sequence mix, which, and she um, also wanted an ATC card if you hadn't um, given her one in the past. So that is my ATC card. So I'll go more into the birthday card that I made. Um, this one is called a curved gatefold card, and I kind of um, put the design of it um, into my into Crooked Design Space to make all of these layers since I don't have the actual die. So I created a belly band for this card and I stamped on Happy Birthday. So it's just a layer of light blue, um, some iridescent, which I thought went well with the paper. There's iridescent colors in here. And then also a layer of vellum, some washi tape and some um, little jewels on here. And that's just the little belly band. And so this is how the card looks and it opens up. Um, I did stamp the flags and I stamped it's your special day. And this is a sticker. I colored in these, you guys, look, guess what? 99 cent Crayola markers. And I added a little stickles on top of it. And then I just have my um, sticker on the back. So that's how that looks. Um, since I was using this sequence mix, this is how I did my ATC card. Um, I did use like this side, kind of created a little circle um, when it punched out on the paper. So I used that negative space that I didn't need anymore to kind of create this hump here. And I went over it with the sequence mix added a little Dollar Tree butterfly and um, added hello friend and a little bitty S at the bottom. That could be for stay space or it could be for Sue, <laughs> however she wants it to be. And I do have my information on the back of this. Now on Thursdays, there is a challenge. It's called hashtag ATCMDC. And I will definitely have the information for that below. Actually, let me grab it. Okay, hashtag ATCMDC Open Collab. It's on Thursdays to help you build your stash and it's hosted by Life with Patty and Bonnie's Corner. So I have been making an extra ATC card um, using the hashtag ATCMDC Open Collab, but for myself so I can remember like the projects and everything that I make. So this week I made one based on Sue's card since everything kind of matches here. I used some of the sequence mix and this is the card that I made for myself. So this is the ATC card that I made for Sue and this is the one that I'll be keeping for myself. So I'm using the same butterfly um, out of the pack, the same blue paper um, that I have left over as a scrap. I did the same, you know, little cluster here, same paper here, same little heart here. I just added a little sticker here. I like the font of it. Month really means nothing to me. <laughs> and then a little hello sticker at the bottom. And it's simple, very colorful, and just really cute. And then to give it a little bit, like make it a little bit more sturdy, I had some paper scraps on my desk in a little pack. And so this is what I did with that. Just a little... I just literally threw all the scraps, but I think that it turned out so cute on the back. Like that could be a whole nother ATC card base. So, okay, that's everything that I wanted to tell you guys. Also, I did have a little craft injury <laughs> um, yesterday. And um, yeah, all I'm going to say about that is give you guys, I guess, a PSA to be careful with your scissors. <laughs> All right, you guys, thanks so much for watching. Until the next time, goodbye.